So if two people break up, um, you know, if it's not Brad and Jen, I'm fine. Rank from favorite to film to least favorite to film, your seasons of The Bachelorette, your season of The Bachelor, and Bachelor in Paradise. Bachelor in Paradise, Bachelor, Caitlin, Andy. Other than Sean, I, the guys, I, you know, a lot of the guys from Caitlin's season are even good friends to this day. And while I wasn't like super close with them while filming, they were definitely just a better group of guys. They were. Uh, and Andy's guys, I mean, you know, they were just, they kind of sucked, to be honest. And I didn't really, like, I didn't vibe with any of them. I was just like, I was the odd man out. And they were kind of, I just didn't really enjoy enjoy that. And um, and then with, and with Caitlyn's season, I at least had the, I was a little bit more, what's the opposite of delusional? Delusional. I was, I was, I was more aware, you know? Yeah. Uh, with, you know, and so when it all went south on Caitlyn's season, it was kind of like, okay, well, I, I I hurt, but I got over it before I'll get over it again. And mm. with with Andy's season, I was just a hot mess of not knowing what was going on. And then I had to watch the haircut the whole season. I was in the sky. I don't. I just don't know what I was doing. And the weird part is, I spent so much more time on my hair then than I do now. Honestly, the scarves on Andy's season were so insane, too. That was me. There was a lot of you with scarves. You know what's weird about that is for all the shit I got from those guys, they really followed me. Because I was wear I, I was in a scarf face. I'm not proud of it. I don't even want this credit, but it's true. And I, I would wear these scarves on the date and we went to Italy and they saw me wearing scarves and they all bought scarves and, and they were all wearing scarves. And it was like, you guys are all giving me shit, but you sort of dress like me, you know? Maybe it's like, the most villainous thing I ever did on Andy season was get them to wear scarves and also look like assholes like I did. What's your hardest moment to watch back from all of these shows? Andy AFR's not great. If I could go back in time, I would have done it. I, I say that, but I don't have total regret because I still stand by the sex positive aspect of it all. Mm -hmm. Not the fallout and the shaming that Andy received from it. I regret all that. Um, the making love comment wasn't, you know, I don't, you know, I, I, I'd, yeah, I'd rather just use the F word and call it a day. Who has the best sponsored content in Bachelor Nation? I don't usually like to vote for myself in these types of questions. But there are a lot of bad ones out there. And I, 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 take a, I, 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 I like to fight with a, like these. With, I, look, I'm very thankful for the chance to uh, make some kind of money off of doing this. I mean, it's an insanely blessed life that we are all lucky enough to have. Uh, but I will push back on, like, I want it to be at least funny or self-deprecating and have some humor behind it. Um, I hope that I successfully do that. Um, I think Demi is very funny in general. And so whatever she does, I think she does with uh, some, some humor. What has been the most devastating split for you in Bachelor Nation? None of the above. I, and I say that because like, you know what? I think breakups are a really great thing. I mean that. I mean that in the healthiest possible way that like we shouldn't be in, in situations that don't make us feel good. And if they end, they end for a reason. And um, I had had to learn that in my personal life. And so if two people break up, um, you know, if it's not Brad and Jen, I'm fine. You know, um, that was a tough one. Yeah, you lost sleep over that one? Yeah, no, nah, I did. The worst style moment or biggest style regret? All of the above. Even on, even when I watch my season, I, I, I really killed it in Paradise. And for all the reasons, it was, they showed my humor, my hair was high, high mo moisturized in the humidity of the beach, and it was like my curls were really killing, and I had the sun. And it was good. And then I decided to wear my hair really high on my season of The Bachelor. I decided to like straighten it. And it was like fine. It wasn't offensive, but it, it was also like, why is it so high? I don't understand. 